Ever tried a ramen sandwich? Really? How about a fruit-filled one? Japanese supermarkets take bread to a whole new level. These are not your typical frozen or refrigerated items. We're talking about daily stocked, fresh-baked goods that fly off the shelves by evening. You just pay, open, and eat. Now check out these quirky sandwiches that caught my eye. Spaghetti sandwich? Wow, that's a lot of yakisoba noodles in there. And the pink thing on top, that's pickled ginger. Pork cutlet sandwich, look at that. It's got a little bit of a sweet sauce there. Japanese sandwiches are quite different from American ones, but they're really good in their own way. All right, I'm gonna try this teriyaki chicken salad and egg salad. I think it's a combination. What I think is really neat though is, look at this, look at the back. You see that? You open it by the numbers. Everything's by the numbers in Japan. The rice balls have the numbers. They tell you exactly how to open these so you don't make a mess. Pulling down. Gotta pull down kinda hard on this one. Pull this way, there we go. And then, tab three is pulled to my left. There, and then, oh, I guess the sandwiches come right out. They look good. Mmm, I love that. Oh my goodness, that is really good. These are four sandwiches in one. In Japan, they, a lot of times they cut off the ends of the bread. See that, how smooth it is? Why, well, I don't know, they just cut off the ends of the breads. It's the kuroke, and then number two is, because it's a four in one sandwich, this is ham and cheese. Now, <laughs> look how thin that is. These are like little snacks. I mean, it's like one bite and two bites and it's done. The next is the yakisoba noodles, which I think is really cool. They actually put yakisoba noodles on a sandwich. And then last one is potato salad. They love potato salad in sandwiches too. Potato salad and carrots. There's a series of sandwiches that are sealed together on all four sides. The Japanese are all about neatness, so I guess it's appealing to them because the stuff inside won't squirt out. Although they're ready to eat as is, there are some that I prefer hot. It says to microwave it for about 10 seconds as is. It smells good. Let's open it up and see. Wow, it kind of looks like a McDonald's hamburger. Let's see what it looks like inside. Not bad, it's smoking, let's see. Wow, that's really good. For like 120 yen only? That's cheap. Let's try the teriyaki burger next. All right, let's give it a shot. This is really good. These white fluffy buns have different tasty fillings in them and they're great for a quick snack. Come nighttime, the shelves are empty. It's all by design. The Japanese supermarket stocks incredibly fresh bread, intending to sell out by evening. And guess what? The prices drop even more, turning these already cheap breads into a steal. All right, I'm gonna snatch these up and head back to the bus stop. Hey, it looks like they're setting up a kid's play area by the supermarket with Ampaman as their theme. Ampaman is a Japanese kid superhero. Just finished shopping at Eon. It's nighttime here in Makuhari, Kain Makuhari. I'm heading back to the bus to catch it back to my home. It's really pretty at night in Makuhari. They have a lot of lights out for the holidays. A lot of restaurants out here. I'm about two blocks away from where the bus stop is. Passing on my left here, kind of a wine bar. The paella and other things like that. Beautiful night out tonight. Really clear. Really nice. 
I hope I make it back to my bus on time. If not, I gotta wait another half an hour. Coming up, they have an outback steakhouse here in Kaihin Makuhari. If you want steak or ribs, they got it. Right here's a game center. Let me show you that. I don't know what that man is doing over there with that game. Doing something. It almost looks like a washing machine. Hmm, interesting. I better get back to my bus. There's a ramen place on my left here. It's called Ringer Hut. It's pretty good. I've eaten there once. And there's Kaihimakari Station in the distance. Wow! Holiday lights! Nice! I guess I'll take the later bus. The variety of baked goods at the Japanese supermarket is amazing! Every day brings something different. They're always introducing new items. Sometimes, the one I liked last week is gone. But the new ones are just as wonderful. It's a bit sad, but thrilling, as each visit is a chance to explore and find something fresh and exciting. This cinnamon roll from Pasco is one of my favorites. In fact, the company called Pasco, P-A-S-C-O, anything they make, I buy because it's just always so good. If you're in a supermarket in Japan, if you see Pasco, buy it and try it. Okay, here's the fruit sandwich. I've never had this before. Oh, there we go. See that? There's cream in it, there's fruit in it. I found a sweet potato pancake. The pancake's made from sweet potatoes and there's sweet potato paste and butter inside. If you're still hungry, check out this other video for more. And don't forget to subscribe, hit that like button, and notification bell. See you in the next video. Sayonara!